There's already been uh, some buzz around your performance from an uh, awards perspective. How exciting is it and how important is it for movies like this when it's spoken about on those terms? Well, I think as far as the subject matter, it's, it's fantastic. I don't believe in things like that until they actually happen. You know, so, who knows? Does it frustrate you that you have to leave Hollywood to find roles like this? Though? Um, I'm come to expect it. And, and I'm, I have to say, if it hadn't been for my agents, uh, Franklin, who's here, uh, Kevin Humane and Franklin uh, Latt at CAA, this movie never would have happened because they fought like a dog for it. And I'm, and I'm really so, and they're deeply Hollywood. So um, I'm, I'm, I'm grateful for that and grateful that they, you know, respect my passion and that they've been incredible partners in helping me find work that I can really um, relate and, you know, commit. She has been in, I mean, when she was little, um, she she was in something I did for television long, long, long ago, but she was just a little, you know, you saw her pass by. Um, but this is the first significant role um, that she's um, done in a movie with me, for sure. Yeah. It's like for the two of you. Well, for we you. didn't have scenes together, which I think was really good. Well, she's the young character, and I'm the older character, so <laughs> Yeah. Miss Close, this is a beautiful piece of cinema. Can you talk a little bit about, for people who haven't seen it, your character's journey and what it was that resonated with you the first time you read the script? I just thought it was a fascinating premise. Um, I think it, it's, it, it feels real. It feels... Human, I think it it kind of um, expresses, mirrors the situation that many many women have been in. Uh, so, you know, my my task as an actress is to just try to find, you know, try to create as believable a character as possible so that it will have an emotional resonance with with other people. And I have to tell you, um, you know, being here and and feeling people's response really means a lot because you're, you know, you're, you're out there and you're trying to create something and to have it uh, so wonderfully welcomed um, really means a lot. What did you learn about Take away from this film. What did you learn about this character in, in the dream? So in your own dream? Well, I have been pursuing my own dream since I was little. <laughs> Um, I didn't, I wasn't in the kind of situation that she was. I could say that my mother might have been, you know, my mother, uh, my father was a very, very charismatic um, man and, and my mother had huge talents of her own, but she always sublimated herself to my dad. So, um, and I wonder if she had felt more comfortable with pursuing her own gifts, you know, what, what a different kind of life she might have had take away from this film, especially within your character? Um, what they can take away. Don't hide your light. Don't hide your light. Yeah. Let it shine. Ladies, as an actor, what is it about the position of Joan, the, the role of Joan, that made you say yes? I'd never seen a story like it on film, you know, frankly. And um, I don't think there's been a movie called The Wife. Uh, it's not something that Hollywood certainly would leap to finance. <laughs> um, and, and I have to take off my hat and, and bow to Jonathan Price, who was such an amazing partner in this film, uh, in a film called The Wife. You know? And so uh, that in itself, uh, I'm going into it, I said, I wonder what actor will realize that it's a story worth telling, even though it's called The Wife. You know? So I'm very proud that we made this film. And I'm, um, I think it's provocative, and I think it's, I think it has huge resonance with many, many women. So. And after playing Joan Castleman, what insights do you gain into her character? Well, that's the whole process, you know. I mean, you try to get insight into the character, and we worked very hard for at least a, for a week, and all during the shooting, to make sure that it that it was really rooted in, in an emotion that I understood, and I could then, you know. Play. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey You Guys!